let's unlock powerful Excel text automation using the latest rejects and dynamic text functions. Let's jump in. First, how to use the rejects deextract function in Excel. New update. Excel just got even smarter with rejects functions. Here we have a list of names, but notice they're all stuck together like Angela Martin or Jim Halpert. We want to separate the first names from the last names without using left, right, or complicated formulas. Let's see how regex.extract can do that instantly. We'll go to a blank cell and type equals regex extract. The first thing to do is select the text you want to extract from, in this case, cell C4, then add a comma. And now we'll define our pattern inside quotes. This is where the regex language comes in. We're going to look for the first capital letter. So we'll type A, Z. That means find one capital letter. Now we also want to include the lowercase letters that come after it. For example, the rest of the name. So we'll expand the pattern to A, Z. That means one capital letter followed by one lowercase letter. If hit enter now, it just gives me the first two letters like an from Angela Martin, but we want the entire word, not just two letters. So we'll modify the pattern again, adding a plus sign after the lowercase range. Now when I hit enter, a sign tells Excel, look for one or more lowercase letters after the capital. Angela, if we double click to fill down, it extracts all the first names perfectly. But what if we want all words in the cell? like Angela Martin or Pam Beasley is the best. Well, the rejects.extract function has an optional return mode parameter. So after the pattern, we'll add a comma, then type one. This one means return all matches, not just the first one. Now when hit enter, Excel finds and splits every word that starts with a capital letter. If drag this formula down, you'll see it works for every name in the list, even the long ones. So that's the new rejects.extract function in Excel, a fast, flexible way to pull out text patterns like names, numbers, or IDs without using multiple formulas. Next, function. Excel's rejects replace function, hide or replace text easily is similar to regex extract, but this one is called regex replace. This function also uses regular expressions, regex, but instead of extracting data, it replaces text patterns inside your cell. Let's see how it works. We want to hide these phone numbers by replacing all the digits with asterisks. So we'll type equals regex place open bracket D4, zero to nine, asterisk, let's break it down. D4 is the cell we're checking. Open bracket, zero to nine, close bracket, tells Excel to find any number from zero to nine is what we're replacing each number with. After pressing enter, Excel instantly scans through and replaces every digit with an asterisk. Now all phone numbers are hidden. You can also use regex replace to remove unwanted symbols, clean extra spaces, mask sensitive data, Format text patterns. RegX can do a lot more powerful text transformations. And once you start using it, you'll never want to go back. Each of these Excel functions are great on their own, but the real power comes when you combine them to build dynamic reports and interactive tools. Next, function, text split Excel function. Here we have a list of full names and want to split them into separate columns. All we need to do is type text split, and Excel gives us an amazing function that can do so much. We'll create a dedicated video on its advanced features later. But for now, let me show you the simplest and most useful example. Start with equals text split, then select the text you want to split. Next, we need to define the column delimiter, meaning what Excel should use to separate the text. In our case, the names are separated by a space so we'll type space inside quotation marks. Now close the parenthesis and press enter. And just like that, 
Excel instantly split into three separate columns, first name, middle name, and last name. Now just drag it down, and you can see all the full names split perfectly across the entire list. And then, split into rows instead of columns. You can also split the same text downwards, instead of side by side. For that, we use the same function, equals text, split open parenthesis, and click John Michael Smith. This time, we skip the column delimiter and use the row delimiter instead. Quote, space, quote, Press Enter, and now the text is split into rows instead of columns. Next, text before and text after functions. Sometimes your text contains more than two words or multiple parts separated by different symbols. In those cases, text before and text after make it super easy to extract exactly what you want. Here's an example. We have a string with three parts and ID number, a region code, and a price separated by different characters. To extract the ID number, the part before the first comma we use equals text before select the text. Then select D for cell because the comma is the delimiter. Close the bracket and press enter. Excel instantly returns the part before the comma the ID number. Next, extract the price text after. Now to get the price, we want the part after the underscore, so we use equal sign text after. Select the text again, and this time the delimiter is underscore. Close the bracket, press enter, and Excel gives us the value after the underscore. Sold the price. Now you can simply drag the formulas down to fill the rest of the rows. Other scenario. If this is my text and set the delimiter as a space, Excel will return everything before the first space, which is the first name. By default, text before, looks at the first instance of the delimiter. But if you want everything before the second space, you can simply change the instance number to two We'll switch this back to one. This works similar to the left function, but it's much more flexible because you can choose any delimiter, not just a fixed number of characters. Next, we have text after. Here, we again select our text, and after a space delimiter, text after returns everything after the first name. To two it returns everything after the second space. You can also make this dynamic using another function. And to avoid errors, you can wrap the formula inside if error. Next, function text join better than concat. Text join is one of the most flexible ways to combine text in Excel. It can join multiple cells or ranges, add a delimiter, and even ignore blank cells which makes it far better than older functions like concat. Here, we have a table with first name, middle name, and last name, but we want them combined into one clean full name column. That's where text join becomes super useful. First, we choose my delimiter, in this case, just a space. Next, we want to ignore empty cells so we don't end up with double spaces when a middle name is missing, so set the second argument to true. Then select the entire name range, close the bracket, and press Enter. And notice, John Michael Smith doesn't have an extra empty space because TextJoin automatically ignored the blank cell. Clean, simple, and accurate. and dynamic report titles using text join. Here's another powerful way to use text join, creating dynamic report titles. We have a pivot table showing sales by category. 
and a slicer to select which categories we want. Now you want a headline in another sheet that automatically updates based on my slicer selections. First, calculate the total sales, equals sum function, then select range, allowing space for additional categories in the future. After, press enter. Then in the number formatting section, set the format to accounting, choose the dollar symbol, and make the necessary decimal values adjustments. Then create a dynamic label using text join. Delimiter, comma, plus space. Ignore blanks, true. Text, the list of categories. Again, allowing for future growth. Close the bracket. And then append siuqua, sales. At the end to finish the sentence. So now my label reads, accessories, bikes, clothing, components, sales. If change the slicer selections, both the total sales and this text label update instantly. And just like that, text join becomes a powerful tool for building dynamic, interactive reports. And that's a wrap on our first set of Excel tricks. From extracting names with rejects.extract to splitting and joining text effortlessly, these functions will save you tons of time. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more tutorials.